guys welcome back so today is like super weird outside like weather wise um it was literally snowing and super windy like probably 10 minutes ago but now it's really sunny and nice out so weather is kind of weird today um it was really cold and it was actually snowing pretty hard like it was sticking but now since it's sunny it's not sticking anymore um so today i'm just kind of relaxing um, last night I had to go see that new Halloween movie. It was a really good movie, actually, and I'm just going to talk about it for a little bit, so if you want to go see it, might want to click off, because you don't want to, uh, find out what happens. Um, but it was a really good movie. It actually had some funny scenes, which I didn't really expect, because it's a scary movie. Um, but it did have its funny moments, which I thought was nice. Um, and then towards the end, um, Michael Myers' sister is played by Jamie Lee Curtis. Um, so actually, in this, um, movie they showed her house like how it was all protected because she was scared that he was going to escape from prison um so towards the end um she reunites with her daughter and her granddaughter and they actually um bring michael myers or like lead him to jamie Le lee curtis's or his sister's house and they trap him in the basement and then they set the basement like on fire like they have all this like um gas that leaks into the basement and they set it on fire so they show him for a second and they have him like all on fire but then they go back and he's not there so I don't know if they're gonna have a second movie because he I don't think he died so I think they're probably gonna have like a second movie um which I wouldn't mind they already have a lot but I don't know I thought it was a really good movie and then before that um we went to Party City um my, me and my boyfriend did we got some candy because they have um a little bit better deals because the movie theater is expensive like all the food's super expensive um like we got popcorn a soda and an icy and it was like $25 which is pretty crazy um so we were just kind of looking at all the candy and I don't know if you guys ever had these when you were little um but I would always get these from I think Walmart um it's these like Wonder Balls they're like Disney candy um it's like chocolate ball with um like crunchy sweet tart candies in the middle so that was kind of cool I found those and a lot of other um candy you see when I was little so that, that was kind of a cool find um and also at Party City we did find our Halloween costume um I can actually go show you guys that right now um, so we are going to be, um, characters from Riverdale. You guys know I love that show. Um, I talk about it. So, um, I kind of wish I had black hair just so I could be, um, Ronnie, but I don't, obviously. So, um, I got, they had this little shirt here. Um, let me see if I can just fold it out. Um, it's just like the little shirt they wear to like practice for cheerleading. Um, it says like Riverdale Vixens on it. It's like a little baseball tee. Um, and it's a little wrinkle because you're supposed to like tie it up. Um, but it has just like the yellow sleeves and it's a white shirt. That's kind of what it looks like. Um, so you're supposed to like tie it up, I guess. And then I do have like little like softy, um, lounge shorts. So I'm going to probably wear those. And then, um, I looked up a picture and they wear those, like, knee-high, like, athletic socks. So I think I'm gonna, I'm actually at Party City, they have them there. Um, they have, like, the little, like, white stripes towards the top by the knee. So I think I'm gonna wear those with the outfit. Um, and I think I'm just gonna wear some, like, skin colored tights because it's probably gonna be a little bit chillier, um, on Halloween here. So that's my outfit. And then my boyfriend, Kyle, he has, um, Archie's, like, football jersey with the number nine on it. So that's what he's going to wear. Um, probably put some, like, we probably both will have those, like, little black lines underneath. Um, he said he has a football helmet, but it's from his high school, so it doesn't match. So I don't think he really wants to carry it around all night. So he's going to wear the football jersey, probably spike his hair up kind of like Archie does, like, in the front. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going to do for Halloween. Last year, um, he just wore a mask and I, um, was a devil. I had, like, red t shorts and some like red sequin um horns or whatever you want to call them. um so I think I'm gonna like this outfit a little bit better I think it's cute um so yeah that's what we're gonna be for Halloween and later today I think I'm just gonna hang out again don't really have any plans um I actually I'm craving uh french fries and honey mustard which is kind of a weird combination um so I think I might go get some of that soon um so yeah I will take you guys along with me throughout my week You too. So I'm super excited. Um, I actually just ordered or pre-ordered the iPhone XR. 
Um, I got that one. It's a little bit cheaper. It's still like eight hundred dollars, so it's a little bit cheaper um, than a normal one. That are like a thousand, like twelve hundred, something like that. Um, so I did order the red one. I like the red one because I've never had a red one before. I think that's like a newer color for Apple. Um, they also had like coral and blue and yellow. I think my mom got a yellow one. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go pick that up on Friday. I'm excited for that. Um, I might film like an unboxing for you guys. I'm just going to show you the new phone. Um, I think that'd be a really fun video to do. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to Friday so I can get that new phone. So this is the color of the iPhone XR I got. This is the red color. I think it's kind of cool. Um, I'm going to get probably like a clear case so you can actually see. Um, this is the yellow one. My mom got the yellow one. It's kind of different. Kind of fun. Um, they also have coral. Um, to me, it looks more orange. I, coral, I think, has a little bit more pink into it, but that's the coral that they had. Um, and then they also had this like bright blue color. I was going to get that. Um, but then I saw the red, and I kind of like that one a little bit better. Um, and I was actually wrong. The price that I have Verizon, the price that they're offering is 750 So, yeah, it's definitely quite cheaper than the other ones, like about $300 or more cheaper. Um, so, I mean, it's the same size, I believe, as the iPhone um, X or iPhone X. Um, and it has, like, the same camera. I'm, I'm not really sure what's all different with it. All I know is that it's cheaper. Um, and I did need a new phone. Um, I believe I got the 64 gigabyte. Um, they don't even make like the 32 anymore or um, a 16 that I used to have. And um, they do have like 256 gigabytes, which that's a lot of storage. I don't know who all needs that. But um, yeah, so I'm excited for that to come in on Friday. I haven't gotten a new phone in a while. So um, yeah, I'm definitely excited to get that new phone. So this week also my mom and I are trying to do a gluten-free diet. Um, we just want to do it just to see, just kind of like an experiment for a week to see if we feel a little bit better. Because it's supposed to make you have like more energy and um, both of us have stomach issues, so we think that this might help clear them up a little bit. So, um, she just went to the grocery store, she got some, um, we did a little bit of researching, like, stuff to have for dinner. Um, she was gonna make a pot roast, of course, like, meat, that's okay. Um, we're gonna have, like, potatoes and carrots with it, however, like, the spices, they have, sometimes they have gluten in them. Um, so we had to make our own, and, um... We also, she also got me some like gluten free like crackers for snacks and you can have yogurts and raisins and that kind of stuff. Um, you can also have, um, a lot of times for school I'll just eat the like, cliff bar for lunch just because I don't know I just don't really like eating a big meal if I have to be in class all day. Um, and those, it says that they might contain gluten um, so we think that they're probably made in, like a factory that makes other gluten um, products so that is kind of like a mm, be iffy so they don't actually have gluten in them we just think they might be contaminated a little bit which is okay um, there's no gluten in them um, so that I'm just sorry I just thought I heard something um, so I'll probably eat some of those and eat like these peanut butter and granola clusters those are okay to eat um, so that's probably what I'll eat just some crackers maybe like some cheese uh, like string cheese or fruit so that's what we're um, kind of kind of try this week i guess i'll update you guys on, on the um how i'm feeling if i notice any different um also just it's just healthy for you so i guess I'll, i definitely will update you guys at the end of the week um and see if it has made a difference hi guys so today is my first day doing clinicals i'm pretty nervous um, probably gonna have to work on some real people today. It's much different than actual school because we usually just work on um, like mannequin heads. Um, but one good thing about it is that we get to wear our cute blue scrubs. Um, they just look, look like this. They're a little bit, they're definitely softer, more comfortable. Um, and definitely at least give you like some shape. Our other ones we have to wear are just like a big long um, like gray lab coat and gray pants. So these ones are a little bit more cuter. So um, I guess that's a plus of today. But yeah, so I will um, definitely update you guys, like maybe on my lunch break and after. So I really hope the day goes well. I'm pretty nervous, but um, it should be okay. So yeah, that's what uh, I'm doing today. So hopefully that goes well. All right, guys, I'm just about to turn into the office, so there's no turning back now. All right, guys, so day one clinical is complete. It actually wasn't too bad. Um, they're really nice and really helpful, um, which I knew they would be because I go there as a patient and all the people that work there are really nice. Um, so every the day went pretty fast actually and according to them it was a pretty slow day, So, but I thought it seemed fast, so I don't know what a fast day is going to feel like. Um, but I worked with, um, I worked on a couple patients, like three of them. Um, my first one, I sucked the lady's tongue in and her cheek, but that's okay, she wasn't too, she wasn't angry about it or anything. 
so yeah actually the first day went pretty well and I'm thankful for that so I go back on Thursday and we will see how that day goes hopefully it goes just as well Round two of late night snacks. We're at Panera getting smoothies. Might stop at Culver's for some cheese curds as well. So I finished off my Halloween costume. I got these shorts um, from Party City because I tried to find some like lounge shorts at Walmart but I couldn't find any and then I just got these knee high socks and I wanted to find yellow and white ones but didn't have them so I just went with these black and white ones um, and then I'm just gonna wear some like skin color tights so it's gonna be a little bit colder. So we got our smoothies. I got the green passion smoothie and he got the peach blueberry almond milk smoothie. This man just shot his freaking straw wrapper at me and our smoothies look delicious so I'm excited to drink them I'm just sitting on the bench while he shops this is normal every week occurrence all right hi guys hope your week has gone good um, so I'm just gonna give you a little update on what I've been doing um, so this morning, I actually woke up 30 minutes late, so I've been rushing around trying to get ready. Um, but, oh well, so it kind of makes you wake up if you have to rush to get ready. Um, so I'm just on my way to school right now. Um, this week, um, as, you, as I shared before, I did start clinicals this week. Um, I had them yesterday. I really didn't do anything because my dentist wasn't there, so I just kind of sat there and just watched um, the hygienist clean the teeth. So that was yesterday. Um, and today I'm actually I'm getting my new phone as I mentioned before so that's exciting I'm getting a red one it's really pretty um, and tomorrow I am actually going to get new tires put on my car in the morning um, and then later tomorrow night I think we're gonna celebrate Halloween we're gonna go to, to some parties um, and then I shared earlier as well that um, my boyfriend and I were being um, characters from Riverdale um, I'm Betty and then he's gonna be Archie I would have been Veronica but I don't know I just think that I go better with Betty because obviously I have blonde hair and I want black so yeah that's kind of what um, has been going on with my week um, again we have more tests like I always say we always have tests pretty much like three times a week so yeah that's kind of what I've been doing this week hope you guys have had a good week and I will take you along with me with the rest of my day and then I'm also just going to give you guys a little bit of an update of how that gluten-free diet that me and my mom were on this week, um, how that's going. So I did break it a little bit. Um, I had like one little cookie. It was about this big. Um, but that's about it. So I don't know. I This is like the fourth day that we're on it. And I just I feel a little bit more energetic. And that's what it's supposed to do. Um, it's supposed to give you um, a little bit more energy, make you feel more energized. So um, I do think it's improved that. Um, as far as stomach issues, um, we both really haven't had any. So um, this might be something that we try to stick to at least a little bit. Or um, just don't eat as much gluten. Just kind of like switch off maybe. Um, do like eat gluten a little bit one day or just eat it in moderation. Um, so yeah, I think that it has helped my energy a little bit. I don't feel as tired in the morning. Um, but it is really hard to find food without gluten, especially like if you're making a big dinner or a lunch. Um, surprisingly, like a lot of like, um, not I don't eat it a lot, a lot, especially now that I'm in school. But um, like fast food, some of that doesn't really have gluten in it, or like the candy doesn't. Um, but the things you eat like every day, like you, last night, I was like, oh, I'm gonna go get a sub, and I couldn't eat that because all the bread has gluten. In it. So, I mean, some places do have, like, gluten-free options now, um, but other than that, it's kind of hard to find stuff that isn't gluten-free. Um, last night, um, I did have a pizza, one that I made at home, and that did have a gluten-free crust, because I made it at home. Um, that was actually pretty good, and we've had, like, gluten-free blueberry waffles. Those are actually pretty good. They taste like, um, if you ever had, like, Eggo blueberry waffles, that's kind of what it tastes like. Um, so those are pretty good. We also got some gluten-free um, chocolate chip cookies. Um, they're super thin. They're, like, thin and, like, paper. Um, but those are pretty good as well, so they do have some good um, gluten-free options out there. Um, but yeah, I just, I feel a little bit more energetic. So did my mom. She mentioned that she doesn't feel as tired. So, um, but definitely if you're wondering like how it uh, went, I definitely suggest maybe trying it on just for at least a week, see how it goes. Um, I don't think we're going to fully go gluten-free just because it is pretty hard. Um, and a lot of gluten-free food is kind of expensive. 
expensive. It's more like in the organic section of the grocery stores. But I think we might do it like a moderation, like just eat a little bit of gluten. But yeah, I think that it was a pretty good experiment. Um, we still have a couple more days left on it, but so far it went well. Hi guys, so this is um, my first video I'm shooting with the new camera in my car. Um, I think I noticed a difference. I mean, I should. The camera is a little bit better. So um, I'm liking the new phone. It's a lot bigger than the one that I had before. So that's gonna get some, um, I need some time to get used to that because it's really big. It's the same size as the iPhone um, 10 Max, so it's like the really big one. Um, and then last night we did end up going to some Halloween parties. They were really fun. Um, I do have some clips of that that I'll um, put in later. Um, there's a lot of people dressed up. Some people weren't though. Um, like some of my friends are having a party next weekend, which is kind of weird because it's going to be November. But I, I don't know. I still, I guess they're going to dress up. So I uh, might as well too because how many days can you really wear a costume? Um, but I actually wore something different last night and I'll probably insert a picture in here. But it was so cool. And my friends did a Halloween look um, and she had she had a zipper down like the middle of my face right here and it went out um and then she put glitter in between it so it looks like i unzipped my face and there was i was like made of glitter basically um so that was super cool and um, again i'll put a picture in um a lot of people liked it um i just kind of wore like a just um everyday outfit with that i had um like a snake skin shirt with just some jeans and some thigh high boots um so yeah i thought it was it was kind of fun because how many days can you really wear like glitter all over your face um and then i think either to I don't know if we're gonna go anywhere tonight, but if we are, then I'll probably wear the actual uh, Riverdale costume. Otherwise, I'm definitely gonna wear it next weekend. Um, so yeah, we had a really fun night. Um, now I'm just gonna go to Appleton. My boyfriend is actually following me back there. Um, I'm gonna get some new tires put on my car. We're gonna go get some lunch and probably do a little bit of shopping. Um, so yeah, that's kind of what our day consists of today. <laughs> So I'm going to show you um, my unboxing of my new iPhone XR. So it just comes in a box just like this. Um, I got the red one. So there's just a red one on the front. Um, and then when you open it up, I can open it with my hand. Um, it just comes with a um, little paper like that. And then I have Ryzen, so this is the SIM card for it. Um, and then this is the phone. It's the same size as the iPhone um, 10 Max, so it's pretty big in my hand. Um, and it's, this one is red, like I said before. It's kind of, it's a pretty bright red. And then um, it comes with obviously the charger and, uh, and also the cordless earphones. So yeah, I'm liking it so far. It's a lot bigger than my other one, um, but I definitely do like it. And it's got a much better camera, um, a lot more storage space. So yeah, that is the new iPhone and I'm liking it so far. And then I also just bought a clear phone case because I just wanted to see the color of the phone behind it. So it's just a plain case. Um, it's like a harder plastic. It's a little bit more flexible. I'll probably get a different one in the future, but I just wanted this one for right now so I didn't get any scratches on it um, or drop it last night and have no protection over it. So yeah, I just bought this one just to start with. Mm -hmm. 